Hello and welcome to Rathod's IES. We are continuing this series of important topics for prelims 2024. So actually I recorded videos regarding important indices in news, indicators etc. Right? So I thought that why can't I keep all the important reports and organization in one place. So that will be very easy for you. Because I always think about like student and our approach will be student centric approach. Okay, so now we are going to see like different reports which are released by an organization. And if you watch this video, you can take the screenshots or you can make the notes of the organizations and which are the reports released by that organization and we put the information in one place. So that it will be very easy for your revision purpose as well. So first let us see about World Economic Forum. So World Economic Forum is very important and releases around 7 reports. For example, here you can get a question like Global Competitive Index is in use. Which of the following organization releases that report? So this World Competitiveness Index report is released by World Economic Forum. And another way also you can expect a question like Consider the following reports. And they will be asking like which of the following reports are released by World Bank? Which of the following reports are released by World Economic Forum? So like that you have to know like which are the reports released by so and so organization. If you don't want to miss that type of questions and this type of approach is very useful. So first one is World Economic Forum. So World Economic Forum releases these seven reports. So first one is Inclusive Development Index. Next one is Global Environment Performance Index. Travel and Tourism Competitiveness Index and Global Energy Architecture Performance Index. Next one is Global Competitiveness Index, Global Gender Gap Index and Human Capital Index. So how can you remember this? So whenever anything regarding development and regarding competitiveness that is related to this World Economic Forum. So here we have Inclusive Development Index, right? And here we have Competitiveness Index. And here we have Competitiveness Index. And here Energy and Environment related to like Environment, you can remember like that. And here Gender Gap is also regarding Development. And Human Capital Index is also regarding Development. So here you can remember Development and Competitiveness and Environment and energy related reports which are from World Economic Forum. So this is the first organization which is releasing seven reports. And now let us see another organization that is IEA, International Energy Agency. So here World Energy Outlook, okay Outlook. So we are seeing across the world that is released by International energy agency okay world means nothing but international right so world energy outlook international energy agency in that way you can remember and next one is united nations conference on trade and development that is UNCTAD. okay UNCTAD. so here it is releasing reports like technology and innovation report next one is investment report Next one is information economy report and trade and development report. So here itself is saying about trade. So here it is releasing this trade and development and even this trade includes like even investments. Okay. So world investment report and innovation technology report and information economy report. So these are the four reports released by this UNCTAD. Okay, so trade, here trade and next one is technology and innovation, next one is investment and information economy report. And next one is international labor organization, in short ILO. So labor means nothing but it related to wage, so global wage report. So labor means nothing but it is providing employment, so world employment and social outlook report. And this one is labor 
rights should be protected so world social protection report so in this way here you can remember ILO is releasing three reports first one is world employment and social outlook report global wage report and world social protection report so these are the three reports released by this ILO and next report is united nations environment program it is also very important united nations environment program it is releasing two reports so first one is emissions second one is directly environment outlook so first one is emissions gap report okay unep is releasing this emission gap report and next one is global environment outlook and next one is undp that is united nations development program undp is releasing this report that is gender inequality index okay gender inequality index is released by undp don't confuse with this and next one is wwf wwf it stands for world wide fund for nature world wide fund for nature so it is releasing the report that is the energy report and living planet okay okay it is about nature that means it is talking about living planet like that you can remember and next one is fao so FAO stands for Food and Agriculture Organization. So which report is releasing? It is releasing World State of Forest Report. And if you are writing your main answer regarding forest and degradation, forestation, afforestation, you have to include this report of FAO. That is World State of Forest Report. And next very important that is Reporters Without Borders. So this report is without borders, it is an NGO. So this releases Press Freedom Index. So recently this Press Freedom Index is highly in use. So you can expect question here. So Reporters Without Borders releases World Press Freedom Index. And next one is United Nations Sustainable Development Solutions Network. Okay, United Nations Sustainable Development Solutions Network. So this United Nations Sustainable Development Solutions Network report which releases World Happiness Index. Okay, World Happiness Index is released by United Nations Sustainable Development Solutions Network. And next one is WIPO. WIPO stands for World Intellectual Property Organization. Okay, World Intellectual Property Organization it releases report that is World Intellectual Property Report. So the name is same, right? Intellectual, intellectual, world, world. Property, property, but here just report. So in this way, you can easily remember this World Intellectual Property Report is released by WIPO. And next one here is United Nations Office on Drugs and Crime. That is UNODC. So, United Nations Office on Drugs and Crime will be releasing World Life, World Wildlife Crime Report. So, this World Wildlife Crime Report is released by this UNODC. Okay, so here same crime is there. So, it is releasing this World Wildlife Crime Report. And next one is UNESCO. Many of you knowing about this UNESCO, right? United Nations Educational, Scientific and Culture Organization. So this UNESCO is also releasing some reports. First one is Global Education Monitoring Report. Okay. First one is Global Education Monitoring Report. So it is talking about education. Again, education related report. And next one is it is also giving this Gender Parity Report. Okay. Gender Parity Index. Gender Parity Index and Global Education Monitoring Report. So these two reports are released by this UNESCO. And next one is Transparency International. So this Transparency International will be releasing this index called as Corruption Perception Index. Okay. So regarding corruption, so this report is released by this Transparency International. And next one is even Global Corruption Report. So here Global Corruption and Corruption Perception Index. So these two are related to corruption. In, okay. So this corruption report released by this Transparency International. So it is also very important. And next one is FATF. 
that is financial action task force so it deals with exclusively money laundering okay so it releases money laundering report okay global money laundering report is released by financial action task force and this one is imf that is international monetary fund very important so this imf will be releasing two reports so first one it is regarding world economic outlook and next one is global financial stability so imf it is related to economy right so it is dealing with economic outlook and even financial stability outlook report and next one is very important world bank so world bank will be releasing all these indices so first one is remittance report and next one is universal health coverage index and third one is service trade restriction index and fourth one is ease of living index so this is seen always in news and next one is global economic prospect report and next one is world development report and next one is ease of doing business so this ease of doing business will be also seen in news okay ease of doing business ease of living index global economic prospect report and universal health coverage index remittance report so all these are the reports which are released by this world bank okay so these are the very very important indices so that's all for this lecture so i try to keep like organization and the report to release together so that it will be very easy to revise and to make the notes so if you are not able to make the notes just at least take the screenshots so that it will be very useful for your prelims and directly in your prelims the question will be like so and so report is in news which of the following organization is releasing that report so is the first method and second method is consider the following and they will be asking like which of the following reports released by world bank or imf so in that way also you can expect question in your prelims 2024 so in these two ways and for 100% sure there will be one question in your prelims from these reports or indices and one thing i want to announce here is we in rathods is we came up with this offline branch in hyderabad so we are also starting this foundation course for offline soon in month of july and registrations are going on and the capacity of class is very small the batch size is just 20 students per batch and there are only limited seats are available so to take the admission so contact us on this number 8074765513 and if you are not able to come to hyderabad and to take this offline coaching so we are providing online coaching also so for that you can contact us on this number or else you can text on whatsapp on this number so that's all for today thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like share and subscribe to rathod science academy